subscribe to Slaya Sushi Shiz. <laughs> Let me try again. Uh, it's okay, it's okay, yeah. Try, try again or that's good? That's good, that's good. Okay, that's sounds better like this, yeah. Slaya Sushi Shiz. I'm a huge fan, you know. I got like this. Uh, don't you mind if I film for uh, Russian uh, uh, and this and their community? Yeah. Yeah, I'm from Russia. Yeah. It's crazy. Wow, it's amazing. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, when did you open the shop? Uh, like, uh, we opened the shop two summers ago. So in 2014. Like late 2014. So how is it going? I've heard like I, I follow the Instagram page and uh, I see like a lot of events, a lot of people here. I think it's yeah. Like, I, I think it's going good. Uh, yeah. I don't, I don't have anything else to compare it to, but yeah. And uh, do you have any like other plans uh, and like uh, expanding the business somehow maybe? Yeah, just try to. I like this energy, like working with people every day and seeing people every day. So it'd be cool to have, you know work on a few other shops and you know, just kind of keep growing that way. And do you have any plans uh, on uh, somehow coming back to music? Um, yeah, I mean, you know, for me it's like if it's if it's going to be working with, you know, in or around Angels and Airwaves or something like that, yeah. that's what I'll do. Like, I'll, I'll stay within that, but I, I wouldn't like look to start a new band if uh, we were able to get... Uh, everyone back together then I would I, I you know I obviously miss getting to play with everybody and hang out with everyone so I would look to you'd be a part of that again yeah that came but there was an opportunity to do that you know and you keep in touch with Tom right yeah I mean essentially yeah we we um, we live very in the scheme of things we live close together like I live downtown he lives in North County San Diego but um, but it still, it still makes it hard, you know, he's, I think, just essentially not working directly together right now. Yeah. yeah. It makes it hard to, to hang out, but yeah, I mean, so time gets away from you before you check back in with each other, you know? Yeah. So you can be like, oh my gosh, like, I haven't talked to him in so long, but like, we actually, you know, but, but at the same time, I, you know, I'm always excited if he reaches out to me and, and, uh, and uh, I'm always, I feel comfortable reaching out to him, you know, that kind of thing. It's just, you just have to figure out a way to like, you know, work. Yeah. Wow, that's great. I, I've actually just get, came from Encinitas. I, oh, I was did? trying to go to the new Tom's shop to the stars. Yeah. Uh, because he, uh, his Macbeth is closed. Uh, yep, yep. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, it was closed today because some uh, like uh, weird guy was trying to like, was like, uh, Kicking the shop or something, doing something. Yeah, he was like some uh, guy, like he was uh, crazy or something, and he was uh, trying to do something with the shop. And the police came and they had to close down. And like the only day I came to Encinitas, it was closed, so I, I felt uh, super pissed off. Yeah. Do you have more days here, or how long are you here? For? This is my actually last day in San Diego, and then I'm coming back to LA because I'm here for six weeks and I'm staying in LA. Yeah. Oh okay. yeah. Yeah. That sucks. I doubt. Yeah. It's probably not open tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, they might be, yeah, probably. I don't know, though. But yeah, like, uh, I met some of Tom's friends, I guess, or somebody, and they told, like, they open every day, and, like, here's the only day they're closed. Yeah. That's just the way things work out, I guess, sometimes. Yeah, but, I mean, uh, I, I, I didn't even, like, dream of meeting uh, you, so that yeah. is, like, uh, I cannot call this day uh, unproductive, you know. Yeah. yeah, that is, like, so amazing. Just, I don't know... Uh, because I feel like people here I used like to you and Tom and like don't feel that it's something special to meet you guys I don't know like because uh, when I was speaking to that to the guys out there they were just like talking about Tom like oh yeah Tom 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 and like uh, you guys for us are like the idols uh, we, you have like a huge uh, interest in their race I mean yeah. and the, like the old albums as well uh, have a huge uh, fan base in Russia well, I think, 
I like in this environment for me, I don't know, well, like people don't know about the music or don't know that like, they just know it as uh, it's just a place to get coffee and hang out, you know, be yeah. social. So they don't relate it to, they don't know it as like, whether it's me playing in a band or it has nothing to do with me as a uh, which makes it very cool in that way. It's very, you know, it's just, it's just about the coffee and the community, really. Yeah. It's not about like any individuals. You know, you know and um, you know, Tom. I think people still get pretty crazy for. You know, me. I'm, I just, yeah, we yeah. roast coffee and brew coffee and stuff. So it's a little different environment. And. Uh, Often, like Tom comes here, maybe never, never, no. because once the cashiers uh, told like sometimes he does. Once, yeah, yeah, once a year. I don't know, you know, maybe a couple times, but not very often. Yeah, that's what I, yeah. That's what I mean. It's essentially we're like very close, like, um, but still hard for I know like him for for him to get down here. Or, you know, I'm, I'm very rarely in North County, you know, I can tell you how long it's been since I've just been, a, you know, even though they're within 20 miles of each other, it's still just, it's just still seems like forever apart. Sometimes. Yeah. Or the days just go by and you just, you're like, oh my gosh, I haven't been up there for months, you know. So, uh, you told before, like, the, the most... Uh the question, like, which is more more interesting for the fans of Angels and Airways, is like, uh, your uh, re return is possible, like. Yeah, I mean, I, you know. So it's not like something, like, for sure not. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I think there's always, like, for me and I think for everybody, we only think of things positively, like, it's a good experience and it's exciting. It'd be fun to try to coordinate some way to go back out and play those songs. And, say hi to people. There's no version of it where I think there's internally, like, there's no issues, you know what I mean? So, so there's always the possibility, but it does, when you, when I really, I think about what it would actually take for us to be able to get everyone to rehearse and, and put together a whole tour and put that on the schedule, that part gets pretty daunting because I know how much work what do you step away from it? Yeah. You know how much work it is to get back into it. All of a sudden, it's like, holy oh, shit. I wish you could just remember to say, fuck it, let's just do it. Like, yeah. Forget everything, let's just go do it. But yeah. I don't know. I also know that maybe that's harder. It's, it's easier said than done. But, yeah, I hope. You know, yeah. I hope we do it sometimes. And uh, what about Fox Car Racer? That might be even harder. That would be harder, but that would be fun too. Yeah. It'd all be fun. It's just a matter of trying to figure out how to do it. But it'd be all be. I, yeah. I miss playing all those songs. You know? I, mean, I love doing this stuff every day. And like I said, I like the opportunity. It's exciting to interact with people, but it's not like playing a show. Yeah. You know. You want to that that part. You'd be like, okay, like, how do you get that feeling again? You know? But I, I must say that like many artists or many like popular people, they make uh, some shops, and uh, they are like uh, you know, it's nothing more than just a place which is uh, devoted, like which is named after some person. Yeah. And the quality sometimes is bad. But I mean, yesterday I tried. Uh, hot chocolate here and yeah, it was so it? amazing <laughs> yeah I mean I bought a few pins from there like on the cashiers because okay. I have a collection of pins yeah. and like I mean I can see the quality out there so yeah. this is a rare case I must say yeah I mean we're, I, I, I approach this the same way I would approach music or anything and it's like a full immersion and commitment you know and uh, I, I, I believe in everything I've gotten to be a part of before at the quality of it right. that I wouldn't want to do anything that didn't have that same level of uh, commitment, you know, and yeah. so I'm very committed to the quality, the production, and everything that we do here, just like I would with music, you know. Yeah, that's right. That's what I loved about music, is uh, that commitment, you know, that that focus, and, uh, and the confidence in what you're producing, you know, you're like, so you're proud of it, you're excited to show it, like, I would never want to be a part of anything that didn't have that same, those same elements, so... Yeah. I want to do everything at that level, and I think that's yeah. what, at least that's our approach here, for sure. That's whether amazing. it's a hot chocolate, whether it's a pour, yeah. or whether it's a cappuccino. Whatever.
whether it's writing a song. It's all the same. It's all the same shit. You just gotta do it well. Yeah. And uh, do you think to make uh, the coffee shop like a chain? Yeah. I mean, I'd like to open more shops, but maybe you not. Know, maybe I don't know if chain is the right title, but I like the idea. of Sometimes we can't expect everyone to come to us; that we have to go to them. So yeah. I would like to go to more people. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, I don't yeah. want to bother you anymore. David Cannon. Thank you so much. Yeah, you got it. Right. Hey, David. Uh, can you say hi to my brother, the yeah. hugest fan of Andrews and Davis? Uh, his name is Leo. Hey, Leo. 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 Nice yeah. to meet you. <laughs> I'm out here mopping the floor, but. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. Oh, cool. You got it, you got it. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Uh, can I have uh, hot chocolate and uh, this donut for us? Here to go. Uh, here. Okay. For those of you who are interested in how it looks like James Coffey, here they go to magazine of clothes, like a Baltic magazine, magazine of clothes, and then the own coffee, here the chocolate. Сейчас тут проходит это мероприятие, там можно попробовать кофе. Чуваки готовят. В общем, здесь очень классно и очень вкусно. То есть это не просто э, кофейня Дэвида Кеннеди. Это реально просто хорошая кофейня сама в себе. Я здесь заказываю за второй день подряд горячий шоколад и это, как бонч. Очень круто. Present like all the way from Russia. It's a uh, it's a Russian pin. Uh, oh, very cool company. Okay. Uh, they're doing like pins and like some kind so of. So is it like a little Jetson car or like a little space car? Uh, a space car. Yeah, space they they had like a huge uh, like collection of pins uh, devoted to space. Oh, yeah. Okay. So this one is like one of my favorite. But like uh, yeah, it's really cool. Oh, cool. I really, like, I mean, I really appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks again. No problem. Uh, um, yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, buddy, let's uh, it out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is just a dream come true, for real. Yeah. That's Thank cool. you so much. You yeah. got it. Yeah, bye. We'll see you next time you come bye. back. Yeah, sure, I will. Yeah, bye. Кому понравилось, обязательно подпишитесь, потому что я постараюсь выкладывать побольше видео, связанных с Блинком, Савой. Я сегодня ездил еще в Инсенитас, в магазин To The Stars, Тома. Я думаю, что скоро тоже будет видео, или уже оно есть, я не знаю, в каком порядке я их выпущу. Но обязательно подпишитесь на канал, чтобы не пропускать. Вот. Всем спасибо за просмотр и удачи.